of the actual day, but it's Monday. Yesterday you saw we, um, I basically edited the vlog that went up yesterday, um, all day, and then we ended up going to this, like, food truck wars, um, in Naples over by where Andy works, and there was, like, 40 food trucks, there was a band, there was, like, um, beer tent, there was, like, a build your own Bloody Mary bar, there was, like, old and luxury cars, um, there. I have been waiting on the mail lady all day, um, I have some packages that came in yesterday and Saturday, or Saturday, um, that I haven't unboxed yet, so I could do it live, because I like to do my unboxings live, um, I have a big one that's coming today, and then one of my girls, JJ, sent me something, um, so I'm gonna unbox that live, and, um, yeah, I can show you guys what I get after I go live unboxing. My mail lady is late AF today. It's like 4.25, 4.25, and she has not even came yet. So, I don't know where she's at, but I'm going to make dinner, and then I am meeting Brittany at the gym at 6.45. Um, so, yeah, that's my day. It's nothing crazy. Probably going to be another one of those weeks, but that's, that's fine. Morning, friends. So, it is Tuesday, Tuesday, and I was going to go to the grocery store yesterday because I need groceries, and I'm like, I just don't feel like it, so I ordered my groceries online. <laughs> I know, I know, but I'm going to take you guys along with me, and we're going to go pick up my groceries because I literally just got out of bed. Um, so, I just use Walmart grocery because... I think that's the only one that really does it around here. So I just do Walmart grocery pickup. It's free pickup. Um, it's really, really cool, actually, and I really enjoy it. And when you do it for the first time, they give you, like, a bunch of free goodies, like candy bars and soup and, like, I got, like, anti-stress pills. They should know that, like, I get really bad anxiety when I go grocery shopping. I don't know why. It's so stupid. I just hate being around people. A lot of people, that's why, like, I try to, like, grocery shop at night because I live in, like, a retirement location, so they're all, like, in bed, you know, so it's really not that many people, but they just don't have a sense of your bubble. They're, like, all up in your space, and it just gets me really anxious, so this is why I really like Walmart Grocery, and you just, like, check in when you're on your way, and they can see, like, when you get there, and um, they just come out. And load up your groceries and you just sign. And yeah, it's awesome. the first one to pull up that was like 10 minutes ago I've been sitting here for like 10 minutes 
and then um, a car pulled up and now two cars are here so now there's three cars waiting and I haven't seen anybody but when I checked in I'm an idiot usually I check in before I leave and then I guess it tells them like where I'm at and so I didn't check in until I get here until I got here but I checked in and I said you've arrived and said no need to call we'll be out there in a minute it's been like forever which I don't care I'm not like I'm not like one of those people but because I don't have anything else to do but still it's just like they've always like as soon as I got here and check and I'm all checked in and stuff like they're out here in like no time like I've never had to wait this long so I'm just like how long are we gonna have to wait and I'm like hoping that he doesn't they don't bring out someone else's stuff before mine because I've been waiting here the longest hashtag entitled wait. I wonder if it tells me when I checked in. Because right now it's 1036. <sighs> when did I left? I don't even know what time I left. Maybe there's just only one person working. Usually there's like two or three. So what you do is you just, you like reserve a time. You can never pick up same day, which is so I don't like that. That's one of my complaints. And my another another complaint, which I don't know if they've changed it, is like you can't add your like Walmart, like you know, like when you do that app where you scan your receipt and then it takes the lowest price and gives you a credit back. Like you can't do it with the pickup for some reason. Um, so I don't know if they changed it, but you like have to reserve the time for next day and it goes by hour increments and then they usually tell you like once you get the email you can come at that time and I got mine like 15 minutes before 10 so mine was like 10 to 11 and I don't know how many slots they give for 10 to 11 but I don't know there's a lot of us here waiting so he just came around to the lady next to me and me and asked who we're picking up for so I don't know what's going on. He's got mine. They gave me a water, which I'm glad because I'm so thirsty. And he said, sorry about your weight. So I don't really like um, you like putting the groceries away for them, like or putting them in the car. Like that's something that they want to do. They're like, you can put it away when you get home. Let's, let us put it in your car. But it was like, it's hot outside today. And they just got slammed all at once. So what they do, it's kind of cool. So they'll just tell you like, sometimes they don't have that exact product that you order online. So they will substitute it and they'll let you know. Um, and so like I got like diced ham for like omelets and so they just had to give me a different brand and if it's cheaper they'll give you the like difference um, and if it's more expensive then they'll just keep it the same price and you don't have to pay more which is really cool and then sometimes they just don't have that product at all um, and so they'll just give you a refund for it um, but they'll tell you when they get there when you get there like if there was anything at all like that they had to substitute or anything like that so really cool so groceries are done all I have to do is just put them in the house um, but I think I am gonna like I've never actually like gone through to make sure they didn't miss anything but I might actually do that just cuz it's kind of crazy <laughs>
talking about how I had some packages coming in and one of my girls sent me something. Well, it didn't actually come yesterday. And so it just came. Andy just brought it home um, inside. And so I thought I would unbox it on here. Look, it says Happy Mail um, while I am cooking dinner. So this is from a girl on my team. Her name is JJ. I thought I just cut it, but it, she put a she put a mail a catalog in here, and I cut the top of the catalog off. Oh my gosh, I just freaked out. Okay. Court, thank you for being an amazing upline. I will forever be thankful for your friendship and your leadership. I love you always, JJ. Oh my god. Okay. This is such a cute packaging. Choose to plunder. Is that what it says? Plunder. So it says, beautiful girl, you can do hard things. Um www.plunderdesign.com Okay. And here I am getting gifts from her on her birthday. Happy birthday, JJ. Some more packaging. Oh, more packaging. So it's a little thing. It's so beautiful. It says exactly what was on the box. Beautiful girl, you can do hard things. Oh my gosh, I love it. Thank you so much, JJ. Oh my goodness, I love it so much. These are so cute. Hold on and I'll give you guys this girl's information. How cute is that? Oh my gosh, I needed a, a, a good like little bracelet like this. Oh my gosh, how cute. Oh, I love it. That is so cute. Okay, this girl's information, she got it from Beth Bomar. Hopefully that like, oh my gosh, I love that so much. JJ, you're amazing. I'm so grateful for you, and I love it. Thank you, thank you so much. You did not have to send me this. Oh, I can't wait to wear it, like, all the time now. I need cute accessories like this. I love it. I'm going to have to check out her website. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 
everybody I'm sorry for the terrible lighting um, but I wanted to stop in really quickly and kind of update you guys on kind of what's going on I can't go like fully into detail but um, I know I haven't vlogged in a couple of days I'm still gonna try uh, my best to get um, the vlogs on regular schedule on Sunday so if you're watching this on Sunday then I was able to do that if not um, just please be patient with me and know that I will eventually get back um, to posting videos on Sundays at least. Um, Sunday we actually, it was like right after I um, uploaded the challenge video, um, the spice noodle challenge video, um, Andy got a really bad phone call from his mom um, and so we immediately went to his she cannot get comfortable are you comfortable are you comfy are you comfy <laughs> so right after I posted the video he got a really really bad phone call she's like staring at me while I talk so um, we immediately went to his work and like packed up some things and um, did some laundry, packed our stuff, and we headed home to Missouri. Um, so it's like a 15, 16 hour drive. We left at like 10.30 at night. We got here at like 2.30 in the afternoon the next day. So um, we are in Missouri. Uh, we got here, so we got here Monday. Um, so it was our like first full day here. Um, I'm actually at my parents house which is about an hour and a half away from Andy so Andy's with his mom um, and so we went up there and had lunch with them today and we went shopping and stuff like that but honestly that's kind of really all we've done today. Um, I don't know how much I'll be vlogging. Um, and I don't know how long I'm going to be here. I didn't bring my laptop, but my sister has one. Um, there's talk that I may be here a week. I may be here till after Christmas. So, um, I don't have my little vlogging holder, so I'm literally just holding my phone. But we're going to make it work. Um, I'm not going to, like, leave or not do my vlogging. I'll try to vlog the best I can. I don't know. <laughs> How exciting or entertaining they're gonna be they're just gonna be what my life my life I'm gonna go through things in my life and you know so anyways I just wanted to hop in and give you guys an update that's kind of what's going on um, but you're gonna get to see beautiful little babies in my vlogs now so that's a plus <laughs> there'll be more people um, so it'll be more people -y vlog and you won't see a lot of um, cleaning vlogs so that's a plus as well but yeah, um, hopefully I can get some more content for this one and I'll kind of add what I did last week because I didn't really do much vlogging last week either. But yeah, that's just kind of what's going on. This is literally my life. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, okay, bye. Okay, bye now that you messed up my hair and you have slobber all over. Ah! It's hungry? Are you hungry? Do you want some food? <coughs> okay. Look at this sweet baby. Hi, Felix. Oh, Remy. I was videoing your brother. Hi, Felix. Okay, bye. I'm jealous.
So Lucy and I are out here playing with the leaves. Say hi, Lucy. <laughs> are you having fun? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, we're gonna finish playing with our leaves. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> so you're gonna jump in that pile? Yeah. Do you think it's big enough or you need some more? Okay. Really? Yeah. Uh oh. We're on my way. Oh no. Oh, there they are. <laughs> my eyeshadow looks really good in this lighting. Okay, I got it. So, we are gonna go to dinner. We're waiting on Andy to get down. He was at his um, dad's house, so he's coming down here. It takes him about two hours, hour and a half, two hours. And then dad's on his way. It's mom and dad's anniversary. We're gonna go get hibachi. Nat, don't you have to do some Christmas shopping? There's a new place in town that's apparently like Big Lots, um, but nicer. So we're going to go there. We're just chilling. <coughs> to make you feel awkward. No, Sam Smith just gives me life. <laughs> Mom! What? You're putting me in my box. What's that mean? What? What's that mean? Who are you? <laughs> what does putting me in my box mean? You mean for real? Like a soap box? What does it mean? It means like putting you in your feels. Oh. Uh, You've never heard somebody say that? No. That's only been a thing for like two years. Oh. Well. You went out? Do they go outside? Go on. Can go potty? Can you go potty? Come on. Hold on. Make hold on. Do you guys feel so refreshed? Are you guys refreshed? Where's your pig? Where's that pig? Where's it at? Oh, Remy got it. Remy got the pig. Give me that pig. What were you doing? What were you doing in there? Remy, were you being bad? You know you're not supposed to be in there. I couldn't get my camera out soon enough, but... I come up the stairs and just see her face looking at me right there in that crack. She knows. She knows she was supposed to be in there. So I have put on, or done my hair to like look more presentable. Um, but I have on palette two. I just wanted to let you guys know. I have palette two on tonight. Um, I think 
honorable transition, cocky in the crease, um, peppy in like the like tiniest of the creases, and then romantic on my lid. Super, super pretty. Um, I love palette too for the holidays. Um, so it's a really good Christmas, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and um, New Year's Eve look. And, you know, any kind of look, any time um, of the year, but especially the holidays. So, okay, sorry for the terrible lighting. Well, this actually lighting isn't too, too bad. Um, so, last night I, like, slaved because my dad wanted um, some Betty Crocker, like, chocolate chip cookies. So, you still have to, like, make, make the dough, you know. So, I made two batches of chocolate chip cookies. We've had a couple since then. We had them all in a Ziploc bag. So I was just doing my mom and dad, or my mom and dad's, I was just doing my mom's makeup live. And the boys are being really quiet, the boys and girl. Um, I forget we don't have two boys now. So Remy and Vinny were in the kitchen. I had them um, in the kitchen. Um, and so I was like, they're being really quiet. Let me go check on them. And I found Remy in Vincent's cage and Vinny laying down. And so I'm like, they're being so good. And then I'm like, something doesn't seem right. So I was like, let me just go see where the chocolate chip cookies are to make sure they, like, weren't by the ledge. Well, I'm, like, looking for the cookies, and I can't see them anywhere. So I can tell they were getting really fidgety. So I look underneath the kitchen table. Let me just show you what I found. I'm like, I can't make this shit up. While we were live, I found it. Literally, the Ziploc bag and all. Now they're probably in a coma because he's sleeping, not paying any mind to me. And so is she. Remy, are you okay? Vincent? Do you feel okay? Why did you eat all those cookies? You know better. Oh, she's, she's Do you feel okay? I'm really mad at you, but do you feel okay? Because I'm just concerned that you guys are going to get sick. No, you're staying in your kennel. You ain't getting out. I'm just concerned. Oh, 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 I think you get it. Yeah. Oh. Woodland walk. Dust till dawn. Seesaw. Seesaw. No? Yes. You like that one? Yeah. Bless you. Thank you. It's only gotcha. since. Is that all you need? What about falling? Here's some old cider. I like them. Can you get some of that for my room? That's my favorite. What about falling in the autumn? Dad, smell the mold cider. That's my favorite. Yeah. Is it good? Fall in the autumn. Did you like my mold cider? Mold? Mold. You're not supposed to smell mold. No, mold. Isn't it like that? Is that how you say it? Mold cider? How do you say it? Mold. Mold, mold cider? Mold. Mold? What's country home smell like? Comfy cozy. That smells good. But that's more for like a January scent. Would you smell apple pumpkin? This is where you'll find the boys. Yeah. Well, I guess it, it's linked to your uh, account. Yeah. You know what you did? Oh, bye. Yeah. <laughs> Say bye, Andy. Oh my god. We're <laughs> nub. Oh my god. Oh my god. Too much. Too much.
Too much. Say thanks for watching. Too much. Okay, bye.